Hey there guys, what's up? It's your boy Pixel Tour, back with another YouTube video for you guys on the channel. And today's video is going to be us reviewing this Darwin Matches Europa League Road to the Final Cards. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. Right then guys, welcome back to the video. And have EA done it again and released a new Ryan Kent into the game? Let's find out. So basically this card is a Europa League road to the final. And what this means guys is from now until the end of the Europa League, if Granada go through, they're, they're playing against my club, Manchester United, in the quarterfinals. I'm very much looking forward to that game. I think it's a week on Thursday we play. Uh, because obviously the international break. But obviously correct me if I'm wrong in the comments down below. But yeah, this card, based off the face stats of the uh, of the card itself on it, disgusting. Absolutely filth. It's got 96 pace, 89 dribbling, 86 shooting, 47 defending, 84 passing, and 79 busy fucking quality. What are we saying? 87 overrated. He's got high medium work rates. Again, he's a left mid. Don't forget him for a left winger because I'd expect a left winger to have high low. So he's a left mid. So he's obviously going to track back a bit, trying to clear the balls out the midfield, trying to get you guys up front. So that's a good card. Then we've got the skill moves. The 4-4 with the weak foot. Banging. So that is absolutely nuts. Then we move over to the actual attributes, the in-game stats. The only problem I, I see with this card, and I have to go back to the actual player details here, is the fact that the guy's from Venezuela, which means the only way you guys are really going to link him is in the La Liga squad, or you guys have got a Venezuelan left back or centre mid or something. But apart from that, he's very linkable in the La Liga squad. If you guys play in left forward, like I said, high medium work rates, just pay attention to that. But obviously the pace, 98 acceleration, 95 sprint speed. Hold for a fucking dommer. Like, Jesus, that shout out to my Dutch people. That is nuts. I mean, talk about... I mean, the thing is for me, pace in this game can be good when needed. Because my favourite player right now is uh, obviously What If Diata. But uh, he's this card could be compared to him. But yeah, then we move into the shooting. 84 attacking position, 85 finishing. 94 shot power, which is nuts. 80 long shots. The volume you don't really fucking care about. It is what it is. The ball goes over the uh, freaking dome of the net. Or Dome of the Goal, sorry, 9 times out of 10 if you try to volley it, so it doesn't really matter. It could have 99 volleys and still not go in, but it is what it is. Penalties are 80. I mean, it is what it is. I mean, for left mid, if it, if it comes down to taking a pen, I wouldn't take it with him anyway. There are better players in the game to take pens with, but it is what it is. Then you've got the Vision with the passing. The passing all rounds, 84. Vision, 82. Crossing, 90, which is very good if you're trying to get them objectives in with the La Liga. But the crosses, that's very good. Freaking actually, 83. Again, there's better players for free kicks in the game. So it's all down to you who you'd use. Um, then you've got the short passing, which is 84, long passing 81, which are okay. They're not great, but they are okay. Then you've got the curve, 74. Eh. Like, if you try to finesse, 74 curve. Again, there's other players which have more curve. Which you... What I'm trying to say is, this card is good for certain things. For pace abuse up front, he's good. For, get, for linking in the one-twos, he's good. Then we move over to the dribbling. And these are two things I want you guys to take a minute for. Ah. 99 agility, 99 balance. Oh my lord. That is Ryan Kent. This part of the card makes me think about Ryan Kent from FIFA 20. Oh, 99 agility, 99 balance. Jeez Louise. This card, you're going to be able to go left, right, left, right, zigzag, zigzag everywhere. Turn around and like do them 8, 1080, 1080 no scopes and shit. Jeez. It's a nuts card. It looks sick. Then you've got the 76 reactions, 88 ball control, 88 dribbling, 79 composure. Composure with the finishing. See, if they at least up the finishing to maybe 87, 88, and then kept the composure at 79, it would have been a bit better. But it is, it is what it is. Defending, we don't really care about because, like I said, he's more of an attacking rather than a defensive player. So let's just skip that. Then you've got physicality, 96 jumping, 86 stamina, 73 uh, strength, and 83 aggression. Again, for a left mid card, very, very good. Let's have a look at his player traits, which are long shot taker with the CPU AI, speed dribbler again with CPU AI, and a technical dribbler with CPU AI. Let me know in the comments down below what this whole CPU AI means. If someone can find it for me and link it or comment down below, that'd be freaking great. I'd really appreciate that. But all in all, I think if Granada weren't playing Manchester United, I mean, anything can happen. We're freaking, we're freaking banter club. So they could end up winning because we struggle against uh, Spanish sides. But let's say, let's say hindsight, let's if they were playing United, 100% gonna get upgraded. But seeing it's a 50-50, 
with the price of it being around 180k depending on what on what you're playing on obviously on pc i think it's around 180 to 200k i mean at least you don't need nymform but still high chem on both of those sbc segments i still think this is a top i still think this is a top if i do complete him i will obviously let you guys know with a separate review video of the actual card this is just an sbc review uh of the card but i wanted to quickly talk to you guys about yesterday because obviously yesterday yesterday i said i'd get benedetto done and i did get him done player moments benedetto has been completed as you guys can see i just don't have the card anymore and i'll tell you guys why i used him in the chicharito spc and boy oh boy i'll be hitting you guys with the uh with the review video on that card probably tomorrow because the card is sexy i like the dynamic image but this card is nuts like it's good like this card has only got 90 balance and 90 agility think about that matches but yeah like i said this is only this is the squad update part i got the chicharito hernandez let me know what you guys think of the matches in the comments down below if you guys have enjoyed this video please leave me a like and subscribe and i'll see you guys on my next one peace